sound maker leads the Kree in Civilization VI, Rise and Fall. He ruled his people during a tumultuous time in Kree history, judiciously towing the line between aggression and diplomacy. Today he is remembered for his work to secure peace between the Kree and Canadian government. The Kree's unique ability is Nihita. They receive their first trade route when they research pottery. The first time a trader moves into an unclaimed tile within three tiles of a Cree city, that tile is claimed. The Cree's unique improvement is the Mechawap. This provides housing and production, as well as gold when adjacent to a luxury resource, and food when adjacent to bonus resources. Their unique unit is the Okichita. This reconnaissance unit replaces the Scout, but receives a free promotion and has additional combat strength. Poundmaker's unique ability is favorable terms. All alliances provide shared visibility, and external trade routes grant additional food when trading with cities with camps and pastures. The recipient of the trade route receives additional gold per camp or pasture. Creating and maintaining high-level alliances will bring you economic and political success as Poundmaker, and your traders will be invaluable to extending your empire. Researching pottery right away will get you off to a quick start as you extend your land and begin sowing the seeds of friendship with your neighbors. Will you stand united and strong with your allies? How will you lead the Kree in Sid Meier's Civilization VI Rise and Fall?